The first boys game of the 2011 ACS Pepsi Invitational featured the Bethel Warriors and Barrow Whalers in a championship caliber matchup. Bethel gets on top early. Cal Coaster takes the give, gives the go. Carly Romer sneaks in the back door. Bethel's up 6-2. But the Warriors leave Whaler Colin Young all alone for the three ball. Can't do that. Barrow's on top, 7-6. Next time down, Glenn Suvlu and Eddie Benson play catch. Then Suvlu robs the bank. Walks away with three. Barrow's on top, 10-6. But the Warriors find the back door open again. Theodore Nanang takes the dime from Carly Romer and draws the foul. The free throws won't fall. Bethel's still down by two. Next time down, the Warriors start to look like they've got John Wooden drawing up these plays. Elliot Hoffman leads Austin Miller to the bucket to tie the game at 10. In transition, Austin Miller feeds Carly Romer, who puts it high off the glass for the two-point lead. The Whalers get their big man involved with a little high-low back door. Tazi Fazi with the sweet name and the assist. Eddie Benson gets the deuce. We're all tied up. With time running out in the first quarter, Glenn Suvlu calls his own number, weaves through traffic to the hole. Whalers by two after one, 18-16. Second quarter action, first possession. Austin Miller with the steal, works one on three around the referee, splits the defenders, tie ball game. Then Miller settles in from long range. Three more of his 15 on the day. Warriors by three. Donovan Nungesack answers with a wide open look. We're tied at 21. On the Warriors end, Theodore Nanang gets fancy with the rock. Draws the help and feeds Miller for another long range three. Back and forth we go. Bethel Warriors up one. Whaler Donovan Nungesack is smothered by Carly Romer. But no worries, he gets it to drop. Barrow's back on top, 30 to 28. And once again, Barrow beats the buzzer. Evan Ullman with the three. Whalers by four at the half, 34 30. Second half underway. Nanang gets to the paint, kicks it out. John Olson makes the extra pass. Carly Romer puts it up, puts it down. Barrow 36, Bethel 33. Warriors in transition. Austin Miller gets it to Theodore Nanang. He works the baseline for a deuce. It's a two-point ball game. But the Whalers strike back. Colin Young draws the help out. Kicks it out to Donovan Nungasak alone in the corner. Easy money. Whalers by 5, 40 to 35. Other end, Austin Miller sees daylight, slices through the lane, gets the Whaler lead back down to three. Theodore Nanang's turn to take it to the rim. Whaler lead is one. Austin Miller goes back to the well, but this time Glenn Suvlu sees it coming. Solid weak side help out, draws the foul, no basket. Whaler's still on top. At this point, we're tied at 42, early fourth quarter. Whalers need points. Even Ullman works it to the elbow and drains it. 44-42. Warriors answer. Carly Romer with the pass. Theodore Nanang with the quick turnaround jumper from close range. We're all tied up. Both teams scoreless for a couple minutes until Austin Miller finds his spot. Cha-ching. Warriors by three. Glenn Suvlu answers. Between the rafters and in. 47-47, just under two and a half to play. Theodore Nanang gets to the paint, banks two from mid-range, Bethel by two. Under a minute, Xavier Edwards sees a wide open key, gets the dish from Evan Ullman, bucket and the foul. We're tied at 49, 41 seconds to play, but the free throw doesn't fall, and we head to overtime. Whaler Donovan Nungasak sees teammate Eddie Benson go to the help on the drive lane, gets around Benson's man, breaks up the pass, and the Whalers take advantage in transition. 51-49, under a minute to play. Colin Young breaks down his man. Sweet dish gets the pill to even Ullman underneath. Whalers by four. But the Whalers ask Colin Young to cover Austin Miller and Theodore Nanang. That won't work. Nanang with the clutch three. It's a one-point ball game. Warriors get it back. Down one. Ten seconds on the clock. Five seconds. Three seconds. 
Elliot Hoffman drives, but Eddie Benson steps up with the block. That's the ball game. The Whalers get to the semi halfway to the ship with a hard fought crowd pleaser. Barrow 53, Bethel 52. That's your final in overtime. For the Whalers, Donovan Nungasak with 13 points. Player of the game honors even Ullman 11. Colin Young with 9 points. For the Warriors, Theodore Nanang with 17. Austin Miller, a very impressive 15. Carly Romer added 12. Once again, your final score. Barrow Whalers 53. Bethel Warriors 52. That's just the first round. Plenty more coming from the ACS Pepsi Invitational.